I think TRL's still listening. I'm kind of want to that dude. Now, TRL, I would bend that guy over and put my thumb right up his asshole. Oh my god! I would just the things I would do to that guy with my tongue and my penis and my fingers. He's You're not, saying he's, he's not, not much, out there, but holy shit, that's some gay stuff, right it's, there, man. It's pretty gay, but it's the truth. I feel like you might not want to talk about. You're hearing a lot about this, and people. This well, was this was sludge. Tell him to fucking take it up with me. I don't give a fuck. I would like to say the same, but it seems like I'm worried about people calling me a bad friend for just not editing a this and putting friend. it out. They're gonna be mad at me, but I'm just. He's just gonna be. Uh, well, how about this? If he's mad, at, if you're mad at him. I think I'm mad at you because you're being a bad friend to me by acting weird and shady, acting like you didn't do some shit that you did do, and you know you did. I've been friends with him for like, and well, I just don't want to be like. The truth out, is the truth. Know. Well, no one is cares. But should I tell him? Should I give him a little warning? This is coming. It feels kind of weird to yeah, not tell him. Yeah, maybe he's your friend. Yeah, I, be if, like she if, totally spilled your beans. If you want to, um, I have. But a, tell you better tell. You also should. You better let him know. I can pull up a fucking security and I don't play. So. Yeah. Security is going to have a turn with you too. Yeah, I, I can't imagine if he gives, you hear that. If he gets prior warning, I can't imagine he's going to love that this is airing. But hey, he has, can suck. we need ratings. He can suck my dick. Ooh. Actually, yeah. no, he can't. Has he already? Oh, oh my god! Already, but, <laughs> but everybody, this has been. Um, Thanks, this, guys. This has been an I episode of Sledge. Ad, bro, I've never asked Adam to not do something ever. Yeah. And the one time I did, it just so happens to fall through the cracks and whatever it is, we were. Here now, so like you let it slip through the cracks. Even if you did edit it out, or whatever, you left in a part of your fucking weird ass homie. I fucking hate that. I always hated that nigga anyway. Fucking Danny Mullen, weird ass. <laughs> He's a fucking weirdo. He fucking he fucking <laughs> exploited the he exploited the fuck out of out of King Croc, embarrassed the fuck out of him, and made him a fucking laughing stock of the internet. And y'all not about to do that shit to me, nigga. Yeah, you right. can't motherfucking cancel me, or you can't fucking. Make me feel bad about some shit that I don't give, I don't feel bad about, nigga. So fuck y'all, niggas. Some black women for a video we're shooting. We're just trying to talk to some black girls. Do they hang out around here much? No. 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 What race is this primarily around here? It's not a hangout place, man. It's pictures, it's pictures for people that need help. With what? You know, food, Medicare. So it's aid for low-income families. That's right. So that sounds like there might be a lot of black girls. God damn, you racist son of a bitch. I'm gonna keep my eyes peeled, sir. Thank you. <laughs> Real MLK has a new dream. It's pretty big. <laughs> Can I show it? Yeah, I'll blur it. The way he shit by the memorial, it looks like MLK was throwing out like a really shitty first pitch at a baseball game, <laughs> and it was actually shit. It just kind of dropped out of his limp hand. You proud of yourself, Big <laughs> Hood? A little bit. <laughs> he said, so, Danny Mullen for a while has been planning this video where King Croc was going to put his wiener in Kazumi, and they were going to film it and basically make a porno, right? He's been trying to pull this off forever. He tried to do it on Plug Talk before. Didn't work. I'm not going to get into it. But I was say, it, you... it was a little out story. We've been, okay. we've been over the past. I, see, I saw a, a lot of hand jobs going on. Okay, so I don't know exactly what happened, but Danny and <laughs> King, King Croc pulled up on her, and uh, apparently he was like able to get hard and was fucking, but then as soon as uh, the camera came in and Danny Mullen was in the room, his dick proceeded to shrink and shrivel up. I mean, I was, I mean, Danny I was like the right same. there, though. Yeah, you can see his was, penis on the Reddit. It's and, pretty cool. And wasn't also Danny was kind of like being awkward and kind of like oh, he literally I'm sure. was right yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, he's a comedian. He's got to try to make the whole so, situation. After he was sure. unable to perform with Kazumi, the motherfucker but why we went he's, MIA. Why are we saying he was unable? I've seen him fucking on but the Reddit. But not like not for any like sustained period of time mm. on camera apparently okay. and so i don't know if he feels like that makes him less of a man because realistically this is probably the hottest chick you're ever gonna fuck in your life and you weren't able to perform but apparently he's gone on the run and apparently what do you mean by the he owes money to various <laughs> people in the danny mullen universe and if you want to head on over to the danny mullen reddit you can just read all about oh, this freaking yeah. we have to understand that buck breaking is a show of power it's a show of dominance so we can't talk about buck breaking without talking about power. Psychologically, when we're talking about the sexualizing of our people, primarily from the dominant society or the system of white supremacy, it had to be established in a very impinging way from the mental state. This whole notion that masculinity is somehow toxic and detrimental to society 
is nothing but an attempt to emasculate black malehood.